What's going on everybody? Wacko Backo here. Hopefully everyone had a good week. Today we're going to crack into some Silver Tempest single sleeve blisters. I do have 10 of them and uh, I feel like it's been a little bit since I've opened up some Silver Tempest so I thought I would try my luck again. I find these all over the place from Walmart to Target, GameStop, Best Buy. Um, and I know I'm still missing a bunch of cards in this so I thought you know I'd give it another crack. While we're thinking about it and uh, it's on my mind, um, <laughs> excuse me, while I'm thinking about it, um, we do have a poll up right now. It's for the video for Sunday. Would you guys rather see me open up this entire legendary collection 25th anniversary Yu-Gi-Oh uh, display? Um, this is all the stuff that's going to be in there. There's five boxes in this whole display. Or would you rather see me crack into a almost full... Uh, case of single sleeve blisters uh, for Brilliant Stars, the one I've been sitting on for a long time now. Um, let me see, my brain's a little scrambled here. Been open up too much scarlet and violet. Um, but yeah, the poll's still up. Let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment. Make sure you guys vote. And uh, we'll be doing that on Sunday around noon, maybe one o'clock at the latest. We'll get started. So, ooh, okay. <laughs> There's a good start right there. Good old Blaziken V. This is from the uh, Trainer Gallery, not Clarion Gallery. Uh, this is number 14 of 30, an absolutely beautiful card. I love how bright all the colors are. Everything is just nice and vibrant. And behind it is a Fion. All right. Definitely off to a strong start. But like I said, go check out that poll. Make your vote. And uh, just kind of spread it around. Uh, let other people know to go and vote. And then, like I said, we'll be doing the live stream on Sunday. Uh, I decided to do the live stream on Sunday to kind of make up for this week. I uh, didn't really have much content going out, just have a lot of things going on. Um, maybe during the live stream, I'll talk about this whole announcement that I've been wanting to make for a while. Um, I did get it officialized and is 100% going to happen. Uh, so now it's just to sit down with everyone and talk about it. So um, like I said, maybe we'll talk about it on Sunday if someone reminds me. Um, but uh, it's, it's really, really important. It's big news and I just want to do it the right way. Um, but uh, yeah, stay tuned. So Drowsy is the reverse and a Cabalion. But uh, yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Obviously, if we do the Yu-Gi-Oh, um, it's not going to be as long of a stream. Maybe I'll throw in some random Pokemon packs. Um, I do have some Scarlet and Violet that I could open up. I do have some Crown Zenith to go through as well. Um, so it won't be all Yu-Gi-Oh, I know, especially because my fan base is 99% Pokemon. Uh, probably even 99.5%. Um, but, uh, yeah, we, um, excuse me, we'll go through that. If you guys vote for silver, or, sorry, I see silver times on the table. If you guys vote for Brilliant Stars, obviously it's going to be a bit of a longer stream um, because I have a lot of packs to go through, well over 100 packs to open up, um, and I'm going to try and rip through them as fast as I can, take a little bit of break if need be, but, uh, yeah, it's going to be awesome. I'm going to chase some of those alternate arts that I'm missing, some of the other high-end cards. I think I'm only missing, like, six cards from the set, so what I might do is... I might do some kind of giveaway tied into that as well. Uh, something along the lines of like any duplicates that I pull, I'll just bundle into one giveaway or I'll do multiple giveaways. Um, something that I don't really do often, so I think that'd be kind of neat. But again, spread the word. Hopefully I have some good numbers. Um, and again, whatever you guys end up voting on, we're going to have a good stream. So um, yeah, come check it out. And like I said, it should be on Sunday around noon Eastern Standard Time. Um, yeah, definitely come check it out. But anyway, back to the Silver Tempest. We've only had one hit so far, and it was that beautiful Blaziken V Trainer Gallery card, but hopefully there's some more awesome stuff in here. Uh, let me know how your luck has been with Silver Tempest. If you pulled... Ooh! <laughs> okay. I was just about to say, if you pulled any of the gold cards, if you pulled cards you were looking for, I still hadn't pulled this up to this point, so now we finally have it. That gold, uh, black and gold Rayquaza with the green outline there, Rayquaza VMAX. And Incineroar. Absolutely beautiful. It's kind of funny that both of our hits are from the Trainer Gallery. Uh, and I don't think I pulled either one of these yet, which uh, I'll gladly take. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. I really, really like Silver Tempest. I like uh, all the Trainer Gallery cards, and I'm still working on completing them from the other sets. Uh, something else I realized, going through some of the other videos and just old like content I have, I really didn't open up that much Astral Radiance. So I want to get some more packs in for Astral Radiance. I'm still missing so many cards from that set, so definitely want to make some progress on that. Crow Gunk is the reverse, and another Gardevoir. 
Um, but yeah, you guys let me know what you want to see me open. Obviously, as new product comes out, uh, I've been doing a pretty good job keeping up with it. Uh, we just recently opened up the Scarlet and Violet uh, building battle kits along with the Stadium kit. And that video did really, really well. I really appreciate it. I was kind of nervous because it was more long form than usual, but uh, it seems like everyone's enjoying it. So I really, really appreciate it. Um, but yeah, like I said, as new product comes out, obviously I'll open it up as soon as I get it. We'll make some content and we'll have a good time. All right, here we go. Winding down on the Silver Tempest packs. Murkrow to Murkrow. Uh, that would have been crazy if we had another Murkrow. Ooh, nice. Very, very nice. Would have been even better if this was the Hyper Rare version. I haven't pulled that yet, but uh, first pull from the regular set there. We got that Vulpix V-Star there. Absolutely beautiful. Let me move these around here. Um, yeah, very, very nice. I'll gladly take that. Especially out of 10 packs, you know, and these single sleeve blisters, I feel like are my best luck throughout every of the sets I've opened up. Um, I'd say the only one that did me any better were the uh, three pack blisters from like Sword and Shield base set. Um, outside of that, single sleeve blisters are definitely where it's at. Uh, let me know where your lucky pulls strive or where you normally find them at. And uh, yeah, where do you buy your product at? I've been, like I said, I go to Best Buy, Target, Walmart, um, GameStop, which I'm not the biggest fan of anymore. Um, but Barnes and Nobles has them. There's a store called Five Below that has it. Books and Millions still has them. So let me know where you guys find all your Pokemon stuff. And a uh, Bravi. Bravia, Bravaria. I always mess that one up. All right, second to last pack. Um, again, not too bad for only ten packs. I'll gladly take it, but definitely need to open up some more Silver Tempest. Uh, what I might do is, if you guys want to see kind of like a random pack opening, where I'll just go around and grab a bunch of random stuff from all those different stores, see what I get. Maybe 10, 15 packs, maybe even twenty, uh, and then we'll just do kind of a random opening of all these various sets. If you'd rather see that, let me know in the comments. If not, ooh, absolutely beautiful. If you'd rather just see me stick with certain sets, uh, let me know as well. Melodic, trainer gallery card, absolutely beautiful. I don't think I pulled this one yet, so I'll gladly take it. Ooh, nice two-piece. Let's see what we have here. Please be something I don't have. Nice, there we go. We got the Chestnut V Full Art. I don't think I pulled that yet, so we're doing really, really good. Looks like all the pulls are kind of just hiding out at the end. Um, I usually shuffle this stuff around, but today I kind of want to just get right into it. And uh, we're doing really good so far, so definitely no complaints from me. But we got two hits from the regular set, three hits from the trainer gallery. All right, last pack. What do you guys think? Trainer gallery or regular set for this hit here? Uh, leave a timestamp and your comment in the comment section below. Don't skip ahead. Come on, guys. You know better. Actually, you know what? I'm going to give away this code here. There we go. I'm going to do four to the front, and I'm going to put this down. Because I have more codes to give away, uh, especially because there are people who have been asking for some of the older, not super old, but some of the other TCG set uh, codes before they went to the new uh, live, I guess. So uh, ooh, I think I saw something peek in there. But uh, yeah, I'm going to keep mixing in all the new Scarlet and Violet codes along with some of the older Sword and Shield ones, and even before Sword and Shield. All right, so we have Sandile. Leafy camo poncho. I'd love to wear that thing. It looks kind of cool and comfy. And what are we going to end off with? <laughs> nice. There we go. Ursa Luna V. So there we go. Not too bad. I'll gladly take that. Three regular ultra rares, or at least three ultra rares from the regular part of the set. And then we got three trainer gallery cards. I'm pretty sure I haven't pulled any of these and they're all absolutely beautiful. So I'll gladly take it. But that's going to do it for this one, guys. Again, that was 10 packs of, of Silver Tempest. Um, again, we saw some more Scarlet and Violet to get through. We still have a bunch of other sets to go through. Make sure you guys place your vote. Um, even if this doesn't win, I will be opening this in another random video. I might break it down in smaller parts. Uh, but again, we still have a full case of single sleeve blisters for Brilliant Stars as well. But that's going to do it for this one, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do, and I'll catch you on the next one. I'm Wacko Backo. Take it easy.